One of the first steps in making breadboard ends is to take dowels and make them into pins. You got to bevel the edges, which means a lot of edges if you're doing a lot of breadboard ends. I've had people tell me you don't need to pin the ends. They're wrong. You do. You just need to make sure you glue up in the middle. Make sure the ends have, you know, the elongated holes. Put everything together. This is always my favorite part, watching it actually pull together when you put the pin in. So you're putting that beveled end in first so it pushes the two pieces tight. And you can see how it's all grouped together. And to finish, you're going to put a little glue on top and pound it the rest of the way through. Take a flush cut saw and cut it so it's flat to the end. And once it's sanded and cleaned up and finished, you can see how nice the walnut pins look in the walnut breadboard ends.